How's it going, everyone? So today on our Wish.com reviews, we'll be looking at uh, Apple AirPods and I guess every variation of AirPods you can find online. So of course, as always, brand if you would. Oh, nice toss, nice toss. Here we have some official Apple AirPods. Um, I don't know what you call these, the generation one or whatever, but so these are about $150. As you can see, he has some authentic AirPods there. So basically, you know, I don't have to give you the whole rundown on AirPods. I mean, everyone's got them. Every millennial, Gen Z, boomer, I don't know. Everyone's got a pair. Correct me if I'm wrong, but I know, Grant, you're more of a Beats or a Bose guy, but me, since I'm mainstream, I'm more into, you know, the good stuff here, but pretty self-explanatory. But my question is, you're like me, you're frugal, you're cheap, right? You want to go something cheaper? Well, oh, that even sounds cheap. These right here, or this monstrosity right here, uh, this cost me, oh my God, one, I think it was $1, yeah, 99 cents on Wish free shipping. So imagine that, so here you go. Um, you open these up and right away you notice one thing, these are, Freaking ginormous, right? So, uh, let me just give you a uh, a good comparison here if you want to take a look. Uh, don't mind the uh, stack of books that I'm working with here. But anyways, you have the regular AirPods here. So I guess I can just open it up for scale. Sorry about that. Um, and here you can kind of see right here. Um, I can just put them down. Dollar AirPods versus the real thing. So right away you're wondering, okay, I mean, this thing's freaking massive, right? Um, doesn't really fit in the ear. I mean, you kind of got to get it in there, uh, kind of uncomfortable, but I mean, hey, for a dollar, uh, you know, you need something for the gym, you need some, something to run with. I guess this works, but sound quality, uh, I can't really test the sound for you guys. Um, I mean, I guess I could, but take my word for it. I would say we're not looking at anywhere near the actual AirPods uh, themselves. But like I said, for a dollar, you can't really go wrong. So of course we have some more tiers here. Grant, I need a great toss out of you. Oof, almost dropped that. So for this right here, $19.99, um, I'll hop straight into it. So you have the nice gray color. Kind of the same thing here, um, a little bit different variation. Um, if anything, the gray ones look bigger, in my opinion, a little bit bigger. Um, so these actually weren't off Wish. Um, actually, my mom bought these. Um, I don't know. It was from some like TV sale or something. Not, not one of those infomercials, but I'd have to ask her. It was something weird. She told me, hey, these were $19.99. I bought these AirPods. And right when these came to mail, I was like, you got to be freaking kidding me, right? So same deal, um, freaking massive. Um, you have these, you have the little buttons on the side you can pair it with, um, comes with each one. So I've worn these, I've tried these out. Actually, I'll admit for $19.99, better than the dollar pair for real. Um, I know they look the same, um, they feel the same, but I don't know if it's like a placebo or what it is for the price, but definitely, better sound so okay that's great and all right you have that i'll go ahead and put these back if i can fit them in the right pocket so i'll put these right here and these last pairs i'll be testing out All right, so I guess we had some uh, technical uh, difficulties here. Also, yes, Grant, thank you for noticing. I am growing out my handlebars. But anyways, that's not the point of the video today. Uh, so anyways, we got to go ahead and talk about these Blue Tone headphones right here. So um, am I allowed to open them? I forgot to yeah, you mention them. So, so to, just before we do that, to explain why we're redoing this part, whenever we opened the Blue Tone headphones, they would auto pair to my phone. 
cutting out the audio. So that's just why we're redoing it. Uh, but just give a brief little overview of these. I ordered them off Amazon. They're about $35. Mm -hmm. uh, the reason why I op or not open them, ordered them, is because uh, they are waterproof headphones. Mm -hmm. yeah. So I use these a lot in the shower, and that way I don't ruin my AirPods, my Power Beats, my Bose. Uh, but with doing that, I found these are really good headphones. They have very similar battery life to the AirPods. They connect very similarly. Like right now, they're in pairing mode. You can see that little blinking light down yeah. there. So definitely, I always personally recommend these. Uh, but with that, what's your thoughts of them? Um, honestly, so kind of what um, I was thinking about and how we kind of have it laid out here. Definitely, uh, I guess, a second tier headphone compared to what we're working with. So, um, and if you don't mind, actually, actually, I didn't actually try them on. Let me actually give it a go. So normal size headphones, not the gigantic pair that um, we have here. Um, I mean, this is the right ear, yeah. It also reminds, reminds me of those old skull candy headphones, right? The ones where you just kind of pluck them in your ear there. So pretty good. Um, I know you're gonna go ahead and do a uh, my kind of a sound test later with these. But, I mean, this fits. This is actually pretty comfy. Um, I mean, I don't know what else to say. I mean, I, I guess it would be worth the 35 bucks you spent on it. Yep. Yeah, as opposed to, because I do have a couple pairs of AirPods, yeah. I've broken one of them. Uh, this is just a much cheaper replacement option for them, which is why I personally recommend tier number two. Yeah. But with that, back to our regularly scheduled program, because... Uh, this part we're just redoing to cover up our mistake. Yeah. So in addition to your shower beer or whiskey, since I know you don't like beer, um, you have your shower headphones, which you can't be like a normal person and play with your uh, play it through a speaker. No, of course not. Oh, sorry. Sorry for asking. But um, as far as kind of monster would I be if I watch porn at full volume oh, on the speaker? Brother. <laughs> Anyways, as far as I know, um, these, I mean, of course you have your Raycons and there's other headphones you can buy off Wish.com. But as far as the AirPod look, this is kind of what we got. Kind of the ones that I wanted to talk about. Um, you know, I don't know if, whether you're on a budget, whether you're just trying to find um, a knocker pair of headphones that you want to, like I said, run with, hike with. I think... You know, the gray ones here that um, I got from my mom, I just take those flying. You know, it, for me, I could take the AirPods when I fly, when I go somewhere, travel, but in case I lose them, I don't want to pay, what is it, 50 bucks for a pod is what you're paying to get replaced. So if I lose the crappy ones, I lose the crappy ones. It is it is what it is. Um, but other than that, I wish I could do some sort of sound um, test for you guys, but like Grant said, I mean, these are cheap enough if you did want to give them a try or just kind of wanted to, I want to say waste money, but um, it's just an idea I'm throwing out there that you could try. Um, at least here, I can kind of lay it out, the kind of um, ranks you have, so from worst to best. Um, with that, like I said, you can find at least this on Wish.com. You can probably find something similar to this on Wish. I assume you said you got these on Amazon. Yeah. Yeah. But I noticed uh, one thing I want to mention too. There is a one-to-one -one, um, AirPod. You don't have to zoom down, pick it up, but you have a one-to-one -one on the actual Apple AirPod, which I need to go ahead and purchase, maybe do a review on that. But that's something interesting I saw too. So uh, with that, I hope you guys enjoyed the quick video. I know the last wish.com thing I did, people were like, speed it up. I tried to speed it up, uh, even though it's kind of a weird little setup I'm in right now, but don't worry about that. It's a quarantine setup. Yeah, it's our quarantine slash riot setup. And when you see the video this was posted, you would understand. But yeah, with that, guys, I appreciate it. Um, hopefully this could be a good um, intro to kind of what we have planned with our Wish.com reviews. Um, just a little rundown is, you know, I I don't know how popular Wish is with a lot of people, but I go on there, try to find little knickknacks, little different things, like I said, cheap headphones or whatnot. So I definitely want to do my part and kind of keep everyone informed on what's good, what products are good, um, opposed to maybe spending $200 on Amazon on the real brand name thing. So like I said with that, we appreciate you guys for watching and have a good day.